I've had more stage fright just to, to like I remember f- filling in for my buddy Ray Luzier when he used to teach at M- MIT. He'd go out and hey Brian, can you fill in this week or whatever a few days? And I te- sit in front of a class. I've never taught in front of a class. You got twenty drummers. You're supposed to explain something. Yeah. I remember almost blanking out speaking. I had to stop. What the hell am I talking about? Because I'm like I was so nervous. But put me in a behind a drum set in a in a, in a big venue in front of a ton of people. What you know? rehearsed ready to go are you kidding me like that's that's like that's what i dreamed of since i was a kid i i, I don't you know I'm not saying i'm not nervous because i'm so badass that i don't i'm not nervous about it's just it should have some sort of confidence if you know behind drums how long have you how many years you've been playing you've rehearsed you're in a band they're paying you to be there and and you've got a job to do this is not the time to second guess what you do with your life you know what i mean no, you totally. want me to like fix your computer well have fun with that that's gonna suck and, and i'm probably gonna break your computer because i don't know what i'm doing you know <laughs> but but uh you know and with each experience you know whether it's studio or live you know you you get it every that's that's a huge that's that's huge you know you can have all, all these tools and all these years of practice but there's nothing that ch- changes those experiences of pressure you know each time you you're in the studio or you make somebody happy or you do a good drum track or you go play live and and you know you did a good job, you know, and the band's happy and you're not getting fired. You know, it's like all that stuff just makes you better. It, it doesn't mean you technically got, it doesn't mean your paradiddles are going to get faster. <laughs> it just means, it just means you're going to sit down each time behind those drums and, and play with more confidence, you know, and not, and, and I think it can go two ways. You can either, some people can maybe get cocky with it and think, oh man, I'm all that, you know, this is what I do. You know, I'm a, I'm a badass because I've, you know, look at me, I'm here. It's like, yeah, man, it's just like there's a thousand other drummers that want your gig. And if you're a little too cocky and, and it shows or, or you start overplaying because you think you're, you know, you know, everybody loves what you do so much that you're going to show them even more than you need to now. And you're going to change the vibe of, of the song and and uh, and that could ruin it for you, you know. So you have to just be smart. Like, hey, man, I'm, it's experience, you know, it yeah. makes you more confident, but you don't want the confidence to overcome it to, 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 to trans transfer into your ego too much.